Well, hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the UFC Undisputed 3 Georgia St. Pierre career that is known on this channel as First Canada and then the world. Yes, so we are doing something different this episode. Normally I record the episodes in advance whilst listening to podcasts and then I do post commentary, but I've decided why not try my fancy new, um, my cobbled together um, <laughs> live recording set setup that I use for Final Fantasy? Um, I use for Final Fantasy X and other things. And why don't we try? Um, why don't we try putting that into UFC? So we're going to do that, and we're fighting Nate Diaz for our first fight in this new attempt. I'm not even. I'm just putting one earphone in for the audio, and let's go. I'm doing the aggressive. Um, I'm doing the aggressive fight style where I'm trying to beat him with stand-up strikes. I don't really want to go on the floor at all during this one. If I can help it. That's a heavy spinning back fist. That did a ton of damage. Oh, nice left and a right. I'm gonna keep backing off and try and do the push kick. This sort of stuff, you know. Oh, big spinning back fist. I'm not gonna let myself get gassed either, because I will get gassed if I'm not careful, so I'm trying to defend as best I can. Oh, good combination. What an exchange here. Man, this crowd is loving it, Mike. What a fight. Ooh, that went well. Okay, so we'll go for high kick. The back fist seem to be doing something, I'm not sure. Um, we'll go for high a few high kicks here. I want to back off a second now and... He can come to me, you can come to me, he can come to me. Come on. Let's kick him away for a bit. I just want to sting him. Get one stinger and I'll want, catch him with one good punch and that's it. I've got some uh, I've got some boosters because I did the um, game plan set up as well. So if I continue, if I play, if I if I play the aggressive fight style, which is what I'm doing in this fight, and it's probably what I do in a load of fights to be honest. But I've beaten Diaz before and. Um, I'm pretty sure I can do it again. We've seen a lot of power shots getting countered by quicker. I'm pretty sure I can win this fight, so um that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna win this one. Oh, sorry, my bad, I caught the record button. I caught the pause button. I've gotta out wrestle him here in the clinch. Working in the clinch, trying to control his opponent. And um, pull back. I do not want to let this one go to the mat. I know he's down, but I don't want to take advantage of this because I'm too worried that... And I've got him! I clocked him with the knockout. Down he goes. Fantastic, that was. Look at that. That was in, like, literally the last couple of seconds of the round as well. I think the timer had actually come off screen from that. So there's the uh, there's a knockout win. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to record different files for each fight and I'm going to Connects meld them all together. To perfect technique, perfect timing, perfect execution. And I think I did pretty well there. I mean, I got lucky. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kevin Mohall has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, fifty-five seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, George Rush St. P. Fight. This is a fight with just Josh Koscheck. I always fuck up his name. Um, yeah, Koscheck. I always, you know, get a bit, you know, weird. But 
Yeah, we fought Koscheck a couple of times, and uh, yeah, let's do this again. So I'm going to skip the introductions because uh, we know we're here for the fights, so let's do the fight. Obviously, recording with live comms, so let's go. Again, another another fight with the aggressive move fight set, so. So this is going to be a lot of back fists because back fists are good for me, sir. Oh, nice shot. Couple of back fists. Let's pull out a bit. Let's pull back. Pull back. Knees, knees. Superman punch that I've been working on. My Superman punches I've worked on. Ooh, that pretty bad miss then. Oh, caught him with the push kick then. I keep catching him with those push kicks, so throw a couple of kicks in there. Have another flurry of back fists. I want to I want to break off his attack with a couple of kicks. Let's pull him in, pull him in, pull him in. Oh, so being close that was. Pushing his opponent away. Oh, he lets him up. Oh, nice left and a right. Under 90 seconds remain. He caught me with a couple of stingers then. Hands up, hands up. Get out, come on. Spinning back fist. Big connection. That one dropped him. He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh, he's in deep trouble here, Mike. That's it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Go on. Yes. Win by a technical knockout there. <laughs> I got over the top and I was able to uh, come in with those diving punches, with those powerful overhead punches, so, yeah. Again, that was quite a good fight. I and with the official decision, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, two seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO, George Rush St. Pierre! George Rush St. Pierre, the winner. Let's go into our third fight. We're fighting Mike Swick now. Now, obviously, Mike Swick is. This is the co-main event of the evening. This man is a mixed Mike Swick is obviously um, someone. He's, he's in rank three, so I think we go up to rank two or three after this one. Um, so let's. And we've beaten him before, so we can do it again. Let's do this. Joe, how do you see this playing out for George St. Pierre? We've seen him work his way through some serious wars, but against an opponent like this, do you believe that he has the stamina to make it to the later rounds? I'm not sure, Mike. I think cardio may be one area that he needs to improve on. If this fight goes into the second round, I actually put him at a serious disadvantage. Huge left and right. Those are snapping his head back, Mike. Whoa, he's pretty, pretty fast, this guy. Sometimes it's better to throw shorter, quicker punches. Whoa! Whoa! What? Whoa! Shit! Shit! What? I told you my back. <laughs> oh, fucking hell! I told you my spinning back fists were good, but 
Here's a spinning back fist. Oh. Perfect position. Insta K. I didn't see, I honestly didn't see that one coming, guys. Uh, wow. Fuck it. me, that was something. I caught him on the way down as well. Bloody hell. Boom. And that's all she I remember saying I wanted this fight to be quick, but... How frustrating is it right now? He has no idea he lost the fight. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Josh Rosenthal has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 22 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, George Rush St. You heard him right there, guys. It is a title opportunity. We've got Martin Campman, and we're in the aggressive fight style, so let's try and become the champion for the first time in this one, at least. For the welterweight title. There's no doubt about it that he is one of the best 170 pounders in the world. And a lot of people believe he'll I'm gonna stay away from those fucking kicks because looks like he can reverse them. So much confidence and he looks unbeatable. I don't plan on letting you be unbeatable, mate. Both men exchanging. Confidence is really high He's after that knockout of Swick. Oh, I caught him a couple of times there. I can't use my kicks, which is worrying, but... Try and control that clinch. Both fighters continuing to try to get to a more dominant position. I'm getting off him. I'm getting off him. From here, Joe. Under 90 seconds remains in round one. Oh, head kick. Spinning back fist. Big connection. I want to take control. I need to try and take control of this clinch again. George St. Pierre with another take. And get off of him. By George St. Pierre. Stand up is where is where I'm at my best. I need to stay there. Oh, spinning back fist on the button. Let's go for it. He got blasted, but it looks like he snapped back pretty quickly. I wanna stay away from that. Oh, big shot. Oh. I got him! I got him, yes! Count it! Yes! Yes! We got a champ we got a new champion guys! New champion! Oh yes! I knew it was coming, I just had to keep trying. Yes! Oh yes! 
I'm ending the episode after this, guys. I'll um, you guys. Uh, the episode will end with the official announcement of the win. But thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next episode of First Candle in the World. New champion, baby! Woo! Yeah. Here's Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 58 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. And now, the new UFC Walter White Champion of the World, George Rush St. GSP is the new UFC welterweight champion of the world. I'm to be doing something, I'm not sure. Um, we'll go for high a few high kicks here. I want to back off a second now and. He can come to me, you can come to me, you can come to me. Come on. What an onslaught of attack here. Looks like St. Pierre's cut here, Mike. Let's kick him away for a bit. Let's go. I'm doing the aggressive, um... I'm doing the aggressive fight style where I'm trying to beat him with stand-up strikes. I don't really want to go on the floor at all during this one. If I can help it. That's a heavy spinning back fix. That did a ton of damage. Oh, nice left and a right. I'm gonna keep backing off and try and do the push kick. This sort of stuff, you know. Oh, big spinning back fist. I'm not gonna let myself get gassed either, because I will get gassed if I'm not careful, so I'm trying to defend as best I can. Oh, good combination. What an exchange here. Man, this crowd is loving it, Mike. What a fight. Ooh. That went well. Okay, so we'll go for high kick. The back fist seems so, but I've decided why not try my fancy new, um, my cobbled together um, <laughs> live recording set setup that I use for Final Fantasy. Um, I use for Final Fantasy X and other things. And why don't we try? Um, why don't we try putting that into UFC? So we're going to do that, and we're fighting Nate Diaz for our first fight in this new attempt. I'm not even, I'm just putting one earphone in for the audio, and... Well, hello everybody, and welcome to another episode of the UFC Undisputed 3 Georgia St. Pierre career that is known on this channel as First Canada and then the world yes so we are doing something different this episode normally i record the episodes in advance whilst listening to podcasts and then i do post comments